Welcome to the EaseUs channel. In today's video, we'll guide you through installing Windows on a new SSD without using USB. Whether you're upgrading or installing Windows for the first time, here are two easy solutions for you. Let's get started. The first and easiest way to install Windows on a new SSD is by using professional disk cloning software. For this method, we'll be using EaseUs Disk Copy. The powerful tool allows you to clone your current system directly onto the new SSD without needing a USB. This saves time and offers the most straightforward way to transfer your system. Number 1. Download and install EaseUs Disk Copy on your PC. Open the software. Number 2. Go to System Mode. Select your new SSD as the target disk and click Next. Number 3. Choose a layout for the target disk. You can choose from AutoFit. It makes changes on destination disk layout to optimize SSD performance. Copy is the source. Keeps the same layout of destination disk. It edit layout. Customize partitions. Number 4. Tick check if the target is SSD to put SSD in best performance. Number 5. Click continue to confirm data loss on the target disk. Number 6. Start cloning the system. Once finished, replace the old drive with the SSD. This method is perfect for those who want to keep all their settings and data intact. It clones your entire system, including the operating system and settings. After the cloning is complete, you simply swap out your old drive with the new SSD, and your computer will boot up as if nothing has changed. If you prefer a clean installation of Windows on your new SSD, using an ISO file is the next best method. This method doesn't require any external USB device. Instead, you'll use a downloaded ISO file to install Windows directly onto your new SSD. Here's how it works. Number 1. Download the Windows ISO file from the Microsoft website. Number 2. Once downloaded, right-click on the ISO file, select Open With, and choose Windows Explorer. This will mount the ISO file as a virtual drive. Number 3. Go to the virtual drive and double-click setup.exe to begin the installation. Number 4. Follow the on-screen instructions to install Windows. You can choose to keep your files and apps or do a fresh installation. Number 5. If you're doing a fresh install, select Nothing when asked what to keep, then proceed with the installation. Number 6. Your system will restart several times during the process. Once it's done, you'll be guided through the Windows setup experience where you can configure your settings. This solution is ideal for users who want a clean start on their new SSD without transferring existing files. The installation process involves a few more steps compared to cloning. However, it allows you to start with a completely clean slate, which is often preferred for users looking to optimize performance or get rid of old system clutter. To recap, there are two effective ways to install Windows on a new SSD without a USB drive. Number one. Using EaseUs Disk Copy to clone your existing system to a new SSD. This method is fast and perfect for users who want to avoid the hassle of reinstalling Windows. Number 2. Using the ISO file method, which is great for those looking for a fresh start with a clean Windows installation. Choose the method that suits your needs, whether it's keeping your files or starting fresh. That's all for today. We hope this guide helped you install Windows on your new SSD without needing a USB drive. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more tech tutorials from EaseUs. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments, and we'll get back to you. Thanks for watching.